All right, welcome back, you guys. Okay, today's video is gonna be on this um, signature Parker that I recently picked up. Um, I have needed a neutral bag in my collection. As you guys know, I am obsessed with black. I needed a neutral colored tone bag that would go with all of my other neutral colored outfits. And so I picked up this gorgeous girl a while back and um, I need to go over all the details with you guys and because um, I haven't done that <laughs> uh, work has just been overwhelmingly you know busy I hardly have time to, to watch anyone's or you know even make my own videos it's just or even comment it's it's quite frustrating because I absolutely really love and adore all my YouTube sisters and I really miss y'all anytime I can spare a few minutes uh, you know I do enjoy watching all those videos and I appreciate you guys and I adore you guys so much, but anyways, um, I'm going to get into the soft Parker, but before I do, I'm going to share a few goodies, you guys, because I hardly ever do anything else other than bags, but I'm going to share a few goodies that I've been just obsessed with that I've picked up, and uh, first off, I'm going to start off with, I love body washes and everything, but I'm not like overly obsessed, until I discovered this stuff right here. This stuff is amazing. I'm obsessed with coffee and it's this, the overwhelming deliciousness of this is like literally a coffee house. And this is um, from OXG and I absolutely love their shampoos and everything, but I didn't know they made body washes. And I recently discovered this um, coconut coffee. Oh, it smells like a coffee house with coconut. It's so delicious. And I just, it's a scrub and a wash and the, so I picked up the body wash and then I discovered they had lotion. So I picked them up and I just, I'm obsessed with these flavors right here because coffee is my thing. Um, this, um, th the scrub in this is not as coarse as, um, this right here. That's why I picked this up also. And I absolutely love using this every morning, but this literally is just like amazing. Oh my gosh. It's just like, Oh, it is to die for. Like you literally open it up, you just want to scoop it up and eat it. But uh, if you want a more um, a grittier, this is definitely as gritty as almost you know glass and sugar on your face. But it, it's super like delicious smelling. Like I I absolutely love. It's the little things that I am currently enjoying because I have no time for anything else. So. I make the most out of my um, <laughs> daily routine of showering and washing my face. But yeah, this mocha and coffee bean uh, sugar scrub from Tree Hut is absolutely amazing. I love that. And then for the body, um, I have been using uh, the coconut coffee uh, from OXG. But I wish, I wish, I, you know, I wish they would make a shampoo in this. Oh my gosh, I would so be all over this because I absolutely love the coconut coffee com combination, you know, it's, uh, it makes your bathroom smell like coffee house. It's so delicious. So, yep, I've been enjoying that. And, okay, another thing that I used, recently purchased that I've been using every day for like almost an hour a day. And my kids, my husband, everyone, we're just obsessed with this. Foot massager from this brand right here. I recently purchased off, off of Amazon. It's got a few settings. It's not too complicated. You know, the pressure could go up to five. We usually, I usually go up to four. And then you can adjust the kneading and then it does also have heat. But we've been obsessed with this foot massager because I am on my feet all day long. It just, it is a must. And my husband picked this up for me, like, actually the first week back at work because my feet were literally bruised. My toenails, like my two toes were bruised from like my, just my first week back after six months of not working. So yes, I am obsessed with, you know, we picked this up off of Amazon. So if everyone, anyone needs a good foot massager, this brand is amazing. So next I picked up these two Royal Albert, uh, T for one sets. I currently have uh, the uh, old country Rosa style uh, T for one set, but I literally wanted more. You can't just have one teapot. 
you know, but especially the tea for ones, these are perfect for making yourself a cup of tea. Um, actually, I do a tea bag in here and a tea bag in here. So technically I have two, but you can just make the one and it keeps your tea very warm. And this is of course the rose confetti. It's like one of my favorite styles from Royal Albert. It has got um, beautiful gold glazing all around and then the just pink delicate combination of the purple and pink and the slight greens in there. It's just so delicate and just a confetti of roses. I actually love it. And it comes with the bottom plate. I love that for your teacup. And then I just love how it just fits in there so beautifully. It just displays so absolutely just gorgeous. Like so beautiful and I love it. So I picked this one up and then I picked up the blue one. It is the polka rose. And let's see. This is the polka rose are one of my favorite the blue with polka dots i absolutely love this combination and all of the beautiful rose details and the little white polka dots and i just love it i love this more than they have um a similar one with the green background and polka dots but i love the blue i am obsessed with blue and um of course polka dots but and the roses it's just this is just right up my alley so these are the things I have time for right now. So, you know, I come home, I have some, you know, tea and um, a hot bath and my favorite scrubs to wind down and to try to just calm my spirit and my soul because, you know, this world is crazy right now. It's just, it's off its hinges, it's off its hinges. And the only thing I do, you know, just, focus on my heavenly father i get in his word i just in his word in his word nothing brings me comfort absolutely nothing brings me comfort or peace of mind like my heavenly father's word so you know just a hot cup of tea and you know getting in his word okay and i'm gonna share with you guys one of my favorite teas i'm obsessed with right now okay so one of my favorite teas lately that i've been enjoying so much i love my earl grays and the breakfast in Paris and then the uh, Earl Grey, the double bergamot. I absolutely love those. But I recently, my husband picked this up right here. And I absolutely love the just so beautiful spring floral. The jasmine tea is just, it's not for everyone. Because it does, you know, depending on how much sweetener you put it on it. But jasmine does have, you know, the bitterness almost to it if you don't put enough sugar in it. but if you put you know a substantial amount of sugar or honey or if you sweeten it correctly and if you um extract the you know the tea leaves correctly it's just you know absolutely just just delicious it just really takes me back so yeah i highly recommend this tea you know since i showed you guys the teapot get into the um coach parker okay oh before you do i'm gonna give you a little sneak peek i'm excited about this unboxing bum, bum, bum. little hint little hinty hint just a little tease there for you <laughs> i'm so excited about that one you guys okay definitely excited about that upcoming unboxing you guys but now let's get into this gorgeous neutral uh coach parker that i have been uh wanting for a while i've been wanting a neutral parker and um the thing about this parker that i absolutely loved it has silver hardware and that's another thing i don't I think this is my second um bag with silver hardware and this is my only parker with the t rose detail I don't have another Parker with the T-Rose um, details, so I was excited to pick this up. And uh, let's just do the little uh, price tag so you guys can see the uh, item number. And it's considered a soft Parker. It says it's a signature soft Parker, but it's gloved tan leather. 
So them calling this a soft parker, maybe because of the binding. Maybe I absolutely love that part about this. That's another thing I drew. That's been drawing me to the updated parkers is the binding. Like the binding is so beautifully done all around. It's like so, um, it just adds such a, you know, such a, you know, what does it add to it? It's just so durable and it'll definitely last a lot longer because it is not glazing. And I absolutely love, you know, the, it just highlights the, the gloved hand leather and on the side and on the bottom, it just so beautifully done, like little, like these little, just coaches just so, you know, so good with their details. But yes, it's a beautiful glove tan leather and it has the signature print on the back pocket, which I probably will not be using this at all because I don't want to, um, see it's already kind of, I didn't pack it right. So I need to stuff this a little bit better. It was kind of empty, but I don't plan on using the pocket just because I don't want to scratch it up. At least not now anyway, but maybe later on I won't care as much, but definitely a must have in my collection because I need a neutral color bag and you know, the beautiful silver hardware and the taupe taupe is its official no sand 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 taupe is the official color of that they're calling this and it's got the beautiful um uh lighter color seeds on the outside and darker on the inside and on the front too uh another slip pocket that i probably won't be using <laughs> but I might if you just slip a receipt in here. But I the thing I did notice about the lighter colored the lighter color like white or gray topes, the glove tan leather, when you do scratch it, it's not as noticeable as it is on the black one for some odd reason. Or it doesn't really um scream, you know. And then on the inside is this beautiful uh almost like a sand color, like a beach sand color. I love that. Oh, that's beautiful. And then on the back, it does have a slip pocket. Y'all, everyone pretty much, it's the care card, everyone pretty much knows the setup. And on this. And then the two compartments. And then the two uh, separated compartments. They actually are separated they are separated on the bottom, unlike some of the parkers. And I like that feature. They are separated on the bottom, but not on the side, if you guys can see. But at least on the bottom. On the bottom, it's separated, so that's good. And, of course, the zippered compartment in the middle and of course i love all of the matching hardware on the zippers and everything and uh just absolutely lovely and really quick i will do the measurements because i didn't go over that normally i do that first ten and a half or yeah a, a little under ten and a half long and Sorry, the tape measure is upside down. Height is six inches high of usable space anyway. Uh, the width is four. The drop is about nine and a half. And you can, you can wear this long shoulder. You can wear this, um, you know, mainly I'm gonna wear it just, you know, I plan on wear just, you know, just like this over the shoulder because to me that's just more, uh, it makes more sense for this kind of bag, you know, uh, just as a shoulder bag. Though you can do long shoulder and you can do cross body. I just think, you know, when it's cross body, it's a little bit too high and short on my torso, but just you know on the shoulder with the two chains it's going to be you know just perfect and lovely enough so i'm going to throw a few things in here so you guys can see what all fits show you the cute little hang tag i love the varnishing 
it's got varnishing on the just all around just so beautiful back to just really lovely and i'm gonna use my card holder i like to use slimmer wallets especially when there's a middle compartment that way it's not overstuffed what else i'm gonna put in there is gonna be these uh shout wipes uh these are the best i will say tide does not even compare to those shot wipes my recent makeup case in the back i usually like to stick that in the back and then i'm gonna stick a really substantial miscellaneous cut in there it's just got you know random things that i need currently you know you know just has a little bit of everything i'll stick that in there some tissue hairbrush and the rest in there and of course I still have room for my keys and my phone so I'm not gonna I'm filming on my phone so can't put it in there and there she is all stuffed and she just looks beautiful and not overly stuffed or anything just very you know beautiful lady, lady like bag you know the parkers are the parker line is my absolute favorite line from coach i really am happy i picked up this cute neutral color and it's definitely a perfect neutral tone it's definitely not too dark not too light just absolutely beautiful and it will hold up nicely i think it's definitely the t rose feature is definitely beautiful the chain detail with the leather and interwoven so yep just a very beautiful great neutral bag to have an absolute little bit and that is it you guys okay thank you again for all your love and support and thank you for being patient with me youtube is just unfortunately on the back burner but I do love and appreciate you guys. I do love and appreciate your continued support, even though I'm not as active on YouTube as I would like, but you know, thank you guys for all your love and support. I hope everyone is having a beautiful and blessed day and I hope you guys continue to have a beautiful and blessed rest of the week. And as always, you guys, I will see you in the next video.